In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to block ads on Safari on your Mac. This is very easy to do and it's actually free. So let's get into it. Once you get your Mac open, go to the Apple App Store and search for Adblock Plus. Adblock Plus has a famous um, ad blocker and it will come up as Adblock Plus for Safari. It only has 3.2 star rating, but it's not just some random ad blocker. This is a famous ad blocker um, in the world. Um, it is available on Firefox, and it has over 9 million users on Firefox. On Chrome, it has over 10 million users. So it's a very, very popular ad blocker. Um, it's free, so all you do is install it. And it's only about 21 megabytes so it's not very large and once you have it installed open it up and when you open it up it shows your settings and I unchecked acceptable ads because no ad to me is acceptable I guess you could say um, but they say acceptable ads are not intrusive as they are the middle ground between ad blocking and supporting online content because they generate revenue for website owners now, you can leave that checked if you think you should, but I leave it unchecked because I don't want to see any ads. Um, you can optimize Adblock Plus for the language you typically browse websites in, so put what language. And you can send data if you want to help make Adblock better. You can whitelist websites, and there's a help and support and getting in touch page. So, that's all there is in the app part of it. Let's go to Safari and look at the actual extension and test it out to see how well this works. So you might have to go to settings um, for Safari preferences I should say and uh, check to allow this Adblock Plus but here it is in the toolbar and I've clicked on it and you can enable and disable it but I'll show it in Safari preferences go to extensions and Here's Adblock Plus, check them both. So now that it's all enabled, let's test this out. So I'm gonna go to YouTube and te show that this really works. So I search for most humiliating skills in football and I'm gonna click on this one. And as you can see, there's an ad right at the beginning. So let's turn on Adblock and see what happens. And it's enabled ad blocking and it's reloading the page. And as you see, there's no ad. So that's very awesome. This does work as you can see. Let's try seeing if this ad blocker works on other websites like Fox News and CNN. And the page is loaded and as you can see, there are no ads. Just news articles and videos and stuff. So that's great. Let's try CNN now. Sometimes websites will give you a warning saying disable your ad block or, or else. And sometimes they'll let you X out of it. Or sometimes they'll make you disable your ad blocker or pay money. Or sometimes um, they'll just not say anything about it. So just a heads up about that here's CNN and there is no ads so this ad blocker really works um, it may not work in every case so that's just a disclaimer I did not make the app or extension so it's not my responsibility but that's how you block ads on Safari and Mac OS like I said it's completely free um, even though the ad blocker is rated about three and a half stars it's, it does work and it's a great one um, it's a famous one um, on devices in general maybe not as much as the Mac as um, on Firefox or Chrome but it's a great ad blocker I recommend it I use it um, I didn't just use it for this video I actually use it so thank you so much for watching this video I hope you liked it if you did please leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and thanks so much for watching